I know it's taken a little bit of time to get the show started, but it actually took some time to get a nice audience. But we pretty much have it. Hey guys, no one will stand in front of you. So just come to the line. Because it would be rude for someone else to stand in front of you. Look, it's perfect. Watch very carefully. Barehandedly. Uh, this is my manager. Gets me all these good gigs. Watch very carefully. And like I said, as I promised, after this, I'm going to show you something you'll remember for the rest of your lives. It's waiting for the belt. Perfect. Watch very carefully. Barehandedly. By the way, this is my, this is my ex-fiance. I don't know who the girl is. Hi, Jeff. They didn't get that joke. You guys, a few of you guys did that stuff. After this, the trick you'll remember forever, but watch very carefully. Barehandedly, nothing up my sleeves. Cigarette goes into the left hand. Hey, this video. Oh, by the way, kids, there's a few kids here. Kids, don't try this until you get home. It's a joke, don't try it at home at all. Try it at a petrol station. <laughs> I'm kidding, I love kids. I got two at home, six and nine. Yeah, stupid names. <laughs> Thank you. Watch this and then the big finale. Cigarette goes into the left hand. I do hate this bit. And before your very eyes. Wow. Vanish. Oh, come on, clap, you bastard. Dude, if you clap with your hands in your pocket, you're gonna smash your balls, mate. <laughs> Don't laugh. A guy busted a nut last week. It went everywhere. <laughs> um, here we go, guys. I promised this was going to be a short show. This is not the sh I've probably done 2,000 shows on this damn square over the last 15 years. But today I came out to show you something real special. It's one of my favorites. Like I said, I hope you remember it for the rest of your lives. It's quite simple. It uses one, two, three cups, three balls, <laughs> one second, <laughs> he's making me nervous, I don't know about you guys, <laughs> three cups, three balls, And a stick. It's not a magic wand. It's just a stick. But it's also a virgin detector. <laughs> but apparently it's broken. What's your name? What's your name? Speak up, you're not buying condoms. Hi, Amelia. Thanks for taking the joke. It's reading one in three guys in Amsterdam's gay. <laughs> Some of you guys. You know what? Two years. It's actually really fucking nice to be out here and seeing you guys smiling. Thanks. Watch very carefully. Three cups, three balls, and the stick. This trick is over 2,000 years old. So not too many people do it anymore, because most of them are dead.
let you run around and explain that joke. <laughs> Watch very carefully. Ball number one, I give it a little tap with the stick. And well, of course, lunge. Now, ball number two vanishes in much the same manner. However, ball number three is much more difficult. You have to blow on it. And that's it. I'll get it tomorrow. That's a shit joke. I can go on. But folks, you might have a funny idea of what's going on. But just wait, because I did promise you, you'll remember forever. This is only the beginning. And one, two, three, all three balls reappear underneath the cups. I am shy up, shy up, shy. I don't need your pity. I need the money. But we'll discuss that in a second. Watch very carefully. This is where it gets interesting. One, two, three balls, three cups. What was your name again, Amelia? Yeah, I remember, Amelia. Amelia. Slide over a bit so you're not right to my side. If your boyfriend loves you, he'll come with you. Thanks, Amelia. Amelia, watch this. To make things a little simpler, I'm going to take one of the balls, put it away. To make it even easier, I'll put a second ball away. But Amelia, look. <laughs> That ball comes back, and it's because I cheat. I pretend to put the ball away. I just pretend to put, but then, when I go to pick up the cup, I just drop the ball, which leaves one in the middle, but that one still comes back. So Amelia, how many balls under the middle cup. One, two. If I take one of them away, how many now? One. Look, things are picking up. <laughs> That's misdirection. One, no, two. Amelia, pay attention. How many balls under the cup? Three. Now, Amelia, You take all three balls. Folks, before I finish up, really quickly, I don't want to belittle you guys about the money. I want to thank each and every one of you for coming out, watching one of my very first shows after two years, and something actually brand new. So thank you. Secondly, do me a favor. Take a look around. Finally, we got a nice group of people together, smiling, having fun. It's been so long. And lastly, this is the hardest part of my show, and it's when I explain that I am a street performer. It's my job. If you met me in a bar, and I made you laugh, and I showed you some magic, you wouldn't think twice about buying me a couple of pints of beer. It'd be your pleasure. I don't know why it's any different on the street. So I reckon 10 euro, cheapest entertainment ticket price in town. Not everyone can afford 10. Five, if you worked from home for two years, you didn't spend any money, so you're richer than you've ever been. So 50. Amelia, thank you folks. Have a great day. It's really nice to be here. Don't, if you have no money, just say thank you. Don't walk away. It's pretty shit. Amelia, I take all three balls. Put them away. How many under the cup? One. It's where the tennis ball comes from.
Thank you.